nah, nah, you know the vibe We see you looking, you should smell the aroma In the kitchen when she cooking She the real deal when she make a home cooked meal She's not nah, nah, the saucy chef, she got skills Nah, nah, the saucy chef, she got skills Nah, nah, the saucy, nah, nah, the saucy, saucy chef, she got skills Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Nana, the Saucy Chef. Today we're going to be making cheesesteak bombs. The ingredients that we're going to need today are adobo all-purpose seasoning or the seasoning of your choice, onion powder, garlic powder, ground black pepper, no salt Mrs. Dash garlic and herb seasoning. I'm using the Philly Gourmet sliced steaks. One egg for egg wash. One can of biscuits. Sliced provolone cheese. And also I have the block mozzarella cheese which I am going to shred. Okay guys, in a heated pan I added my steak on. I'm just going to season it now with some ground black pepper, some adobo all-purpose seasoning, some onion powder, and some garlic powder. And you guys are welcome to go ahead and add onion or green pepper to yours. I'm just making mine simple today. So we're just going to go ahead and mix that in and let it cook. After your steakums are cooked all the way through, you want to turn off the heat and you want to remove them from your pan and drain them of all excess grease and then sit them in the bowl to the side. Okay guys, once you drain the excess grease from your steakums, put them back into your pan. And now I'm just going to add two pieces of the sliced provolone cheese over top and we're going to let that melt into our steakums. All you want to do is break it down and mix it into the steakum and make sure it's melted all the way. Then we're going to remove it from our pan and set it to the side. Okay guys, next I'm going to go ahead and shred my mozzarella cheese. I'm using low moisture. I'm going to be shredding a little bit less than half of the block. Okay guys, I also took two slices of the provolone cheese and just cut it into pieces also. Okay guys, next we're going to go ahead and open our biscuits. Okay guys, now all we're going to do is go ahead and stretch our biscuit. So I'm going to go ahead and take my rolling pin and just roll it out a little bit. Okay guys, so now to the center, we're going to add some of the mozzarella cheese and I'm also going to add a few slices of the provolone on top. Next I'm going to add my steakum to the top. Now all we're going to do is pull from the edges and we're just going to keep going around until we fold it into a ball. You want to pinch all the dough together and you want to make sure there are no holes in your biscuit dough. Now we're going to repeat the process. Guys, while you're making your cheesesteak bombs, you can set your oven to 350 degrees. Once you're done making your cheesesteak bombs, you want to place them onto a baking sheet. Next, we're going to go ahead and place the egg wash over top of them. You want to coat them all the way around.
Once you're done, you're going to sprinkle some Mrs. Dash with the garlic and herb over top for some added flavor. Now we're going to place them in our oven at 350 degrees for 15 minutes. Okay guys, our cheese steak bombs are done. And look how pretty they came out. I'll let them cool off before I remove them from our baking pan. Okay guys, here goes our cheese steak bombs. They came out perfect. So I'm just going to go ahead and cut into one for you. They're too hot to handle right now. How nice and cheesy that is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please come back. Please like and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching. Feel free to leave a comment. And until next time, this is Nana, the Saucy Chef.